several hundred years from now, and with multiple breakthroughs in understanding the fundamentals of space and time, mankind set sail to the stars. The Terran War Machine implies that you have endless recruits available for which you just need to build the weapons as armor suits, rifles, or complete tanks to muster them. Terrans descend from us, humans, and just recently arrived in the Starcraft part of the galaxy, which is labeled the Koprulu Sector. The harsh life on alien planets and conflict between several Terran factions, as well as being in war with two powerful alien races, forced the Terran to build an insanely military-industrialized complex to survive. A Terran force arrives in a Hercules ship or similar transport, often guarded by armed battlecruisers. The frigates that turn away to protect the next military transport while the supply ship stays in orbit. The command center is dropped on the planet, performs a soft landing, and releases some pioneers. The base cannot be set too close to minerals or geysers, as the weight of the massive headquarters building would interact with the sensible geology often found too close to either of the resources. The Terran Commander begins with this command center and his base of operations. It provides radio stations to communicate with every unit to give them orders. Six initial space construction vehicles, SCVs, are also provided. Any Terran Commander can gain access to a Terran satellite which orbits above the base and was installed there prior to the landing of the command center as part of the Terran military.